In this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, check for water damage on an iPhone 4S GSM model. Uh, there are two sensors you can see from the outside of the phone without taking it apart. One is at the bottom. If you see that uh, little red indicator down there beneath the 30 pin connector. Red means it's water damage. This phone is water damage. Uh, white means it's not. So that's one. That's at the bottom. The other one is at the top in the headphone jack. It is also red if you can see that. And now there are two internal ones. You To get to them, you have to take out two screws there, which are already out in this phone. Slide the back up. Take it off, and the water must have not touched this one, but one is right there. And, uh, and that's it. Uh, sorry, I thought I must have been thinking of the iPhone 5. It has two internal ones, but yeah. That's the main internal one right there. It's white, not water damaged, red, water damaged. Again, this may not be red because Pop, this is actually put in a bag with uh, Coca-Cola in it. And as you can see, there's some moisture right there. The water must have not got to here so it doesn't show as red, but the phone's still water damaged because it definitely touched down here and it definitely touched in there. And in my opinion, if one of them is red, then water's touched it before, so it is not the same as a non-water damaged phone.